the question is sodium monofluoroflastoate is preferable topical fluoride agent over stannous fluoride because the latter causes okay so you have three agents which are used as topical fluoride agents one is sodium fluoride the other one is stannous fluoride and the third one is acidulated phosphate fluoride okay apf the most commonly used right now is apf because uh, it is easily available and it can be easily made stannous fluoride has one disadvantage is that it has to be freshly made every time because it can easily uh, it cannot be stored for a long period of time because it reacts with the glass or it can react with any medium so it has to be freshly prepared sodium fluoride is basically the most commonly used uh, agent in all your other topical fluoride agents such as your varnish your uh, toothpaste all of them have sodium monofluorofluoroflastoate that is your sodium fluoride is the one agent which is used as your fluoride agent why because it is easily available it is easy to make it is easy to procure and it is it has a sustained effect so it is useful okay but one of the most important things that you need to remember is see this is from your soap and peter soap and peter there is one entire table which is given that table has to be learned by heart because a lot of questions are asked on fluoride day in and day out okay now if you look at this the caries reduction actually is the highest for stannous fluoride as compared to sodium fluoride and apf now sodium fluoride one more important the biggest advantage is that it has a neutral ph of 7 now because it has this neutral ph it is tasteless it is odorless it is not erosion it does not cause erosion of any of the tooth surface and it does not cause any irritation to any of the tissues because of its neutral ph apf on the other hand because it is acidic in nature what it has been said is that the apf it causes it etching of the superficial enamel because it causes etching the surface area increases and because of the increased surface area more fluoride is actually getting incorporated onto the tooth enamel that is what they say as a result fluor appetite forms much better on when used apf however the caries reduction is lesser than that of stannous fluoride now like i told you stannous fluoride has to be pro, uh, premixed or made freshly every time because it cannot be stored because it is very it is a very volatile compound but on the other hand one more important property of stannous fluoride is that it is because it contains tin tin is a very erosive metal so when it comes in contact with human tissue it causes a lot of irrit irritation and a lot of uh, erosion so in addition to that one more thing that you need to remember is tin also has the ability to cause staining that is the reason when you use tin containing compounds it causes some amount because it is a metal it causes easy staining of the tooth structure so coming to the answer over here the answer will be staining why because of the presence of tin and the great second greatest disadvantage of tin fluorophosphate or tin fluoride is that stannous fluoride is that it is going to cause a lot of irritation because tin as as such is a very erosive and irritating metal that is why okay